So this is day two of our trek and uh, we are starting from our lodge where we stayed from Tumling and as you can see the view is very very splendid. See Kanchanyunga on the other side. This is Tumling that you have seen. We stayed at Sakit Lodge which was pretty amazing. Right, we have Kanchanzonga, and as Prayash says today, mountain is smiling. Himal Asira Kosa. This also looks like a snake way, which I have mentioned in one of my poems. Maybe in future, if I publish the series called uh, Sketches of Places, we'll get to read those. So we are heading towards Gairi Bas now and uh, this is the track route which goes right to SSB camp. Uh, I did not take that video because we are not allowed to record that side. Yeah. So we've been here before once and it's a very beautiful track. Sadly, uh, we don't want to drag the rock very long, so I'll be only showing you clips here and there. As you can see, a lot of wilderness over there. So here we are next to the super and site will be in Nepal for you all right and uh, you would see Kanchanzonga there uh, I think still you can see some part of it if not all it's cloudy so we hiked from this mountain and then we've reached here finally so we'll wait for our friends here and then we'll again take our trail so we are on the Nepal side of the border, the fence, and uh, that's Jawari, I believe. And so they have this practice of preserving rainwater in this manner. So it's a plastic sheet that they've laid down in a, they've dug a hole and they've laid down the plastic sheet and they collect water from there. I don't know how, how do they use it, but as you can see there are like patches of those water reservoirs here <laughs> so yeah <laughs> So that is how we came down and again we'll be going down this route from the street uh, from this road and then we had to so we came from here right and then you don't go straight you take a right uh, if you're going to Kalpokri and Sandhupu so Sumiron, you just came back from Germany. <laughs> and we have something, the Tibetan Mastiff over here, I believe. Do you watch the So he's just two years old. And he's huge. <laughs> Massive. And uh, this 
nice old gentleman. He showed us the way towards Kalpoka. धन्यवाद he showed us the way and we're headed so we are supposed to follow this trail and climb up to somewhere around there <laughs> there's Kalpokri and again we climb up to what do you call it mountains no Sandakfu Sandakfu would be somewhere around there on top okay. the hill and Falut would be again going this side from there we can see uh, what do you call it? Kanchunzanga much closer. Mount Everest. Rahul, you just came back from Korea. Not Korea. Not <laughs> Kim Son. Son. Kim Son. Kim Son who? Kim Son. Oh. Refugee. Ayush. This guy is from Indonesia. How are you sir? Hello. Fresh. Can you say hi to the camera, please? He's from Vietnam. <laughs> where, where is where's this Thai guy? Where is it? So you can see the goat trying to climb the. Lady boy. Lady boy. He came from Bhutan. All the way from Bhutan. Ashish. This guy is from Thailand. I'm not lady. I'm lady boy. <laughs> So as you can see, this is a multicultural hike we are going on trek. It's a very beautiful village. So it's supposed to be a 12 kilometer hike till Kalpokari but then since we're taking this off-road trail it only seems to get steeper <laughs> so it's as though you're climbing the mountains directly the hills that's the road few traces of Guras put on the runs. Yes, <laughs> So we are at Kal Pukiri now, finally after hiking for how many hours? Five, five to six hours. Uh, yeah, five, five hours. From Tumling, uh, we finally reached Karl Pokhari and we'll be staying around this place today. Uh, today we'll be holding here and we'll start our trek tomorrow to Sandakfu.